Hello everyone. I thought I'd give you a new gameplay sample today. A game that I've been trying out very recently called No Man's Sky. It's a sci-fi survival exploration building kind of game. I am uh, currently on a, a paradise world which is Earth-like and has basically no major hazards that you have to worry about. Lots of plant and animal life. You can see here that one of the defining fauna animals on this planet are these gigantic yellow moths. They're pretty. I like them. It's one of the reasons I decided to take a video here. Let's see how close we can get to one of them before they fly away. As we get a little bit closer, it looks like Maybe kind of a cross between a bat and a moth. See those those wings have uh, some kind of veiny structure in them. Makes it look a little bit more like bat wings when you get up close, but I think they look an awful lot like moths. Just wanted to show you that. So <clears throat> I'm still working through the tutorial in this game. I'm probably going to start, or I may start a series of videos once I get through the tutorial, start over again on a higher difficulty. You know, I prefer to do hardcore kinds of games where, you know, death is permanent, so I might start a video series when I'm ready to start one of those more hardcore play experiences. But just before I end this video today, I'm going to do one little event to give you a taste of what this game is like. So I have here a planetary chart, which will help me find some kind of manufacturing facility. So I'm just going to use that. It's going to send off a big radar pulse, I guess. and. Uh, and it's found an operations center for me. I'm going to go take my ship that you can see right here. I'm going to go explore it real quick. And we'll call that good for today. This is just a gameplay sample. So this is my ship. My space fighter craft. So we've got an ETA there of just five or six seconds. That one was actually really close. I may have already explored this one. There might not be anything new to see here. Now we're going to land our ship and go take a look. If it's one I've already seen, I'm not sure I'm going to... I might do one more, make it send me a little bit farther away. Let's see if I've done this one before. Now it says unknown sector, so I haven't been here before. <clears throat> so this is how you save your game. There are other ways, of course, but this is probably the most common way to save your game is to find one of these cartography points. It's a really nice planet. It's got red atmosphere, which is unusual. Lots of tropical looking trees, but these fancy grasses and everything all swaying in the breeze. Really pretty game. I like it. I'll probably be playing this one quite a bit in the near future. <clears throat> now, let's scan the outside of this facility. Search, I should say, the outside of this facility before we head in. See what's inside. Get a little sprinting. Oh, that's a sentinel. Huh. I thought I had deactivated the sentinels on this world. Well, you'll get a taste of the sentinel combat. This place is pretty dangerous looking. Maybe that's the only one. I was pretty sure I deactivated all the sentinels on this world. But that one's still roaming around. He's really big probably really dangerous. Well, as it so happens, I recently picked up a rifle. So 
this will give us a chance to try it out. Where'd that guy go? There he is. Let's see if we can zoom in here. Sentinel quad, that's all it has to tell me. Okay, well. Let's see if we can get in here. Door is reinforced. So we're going to have to shoot it down. Oh, that's the mining beam. Let's switch to the bullet part of the rifle. It's a nice little kick of damage. They're looking for me. I better run and hide or fight or something. I don't have very many bullets. Oh boy, there's so many. There's so many. They found me. I'm not sure I can fight that many at once. I do kind of want to fight that quad though. Oops. I am going to fight that quad if I can find it. to no longer be among us. Oh, there it is. Let's not shoot our ship while we're shooting at him. Oops, dang it. <laughs> that one's trying to repair him. Let's get rid of him. That one's also trying to repair him. Let's get rid of him. And him, he's doing the same thing. Get out of here. Get out of here. Don't you know I'm trying to kill a powerful enemy here? Making my life difficult. Where's... Alright, that's all the repair bots. Ooh, whip pounces. Ooh, maybe it repairs itself. That's not fair. Whoa, that laser almost got me. All right, I killed it. Pick up my loot and get the heck out of here. There's too many of them. I've never fought one of those before. You see, it's recorded it to the catalog. Quad Servo. So, if I manage to destroy all of those Sentinels, it'll escalate the threat level like it did just there. I guess killing one of those powerful sentinels was enough to escalate the threat level all by itself. So these sentinels are kind of a, an unstoppable force. So you can fight a little bit, but eventually you're going to have to run away. So that's what we've done. I'll lose them. I lost them. Now I'm going to run inside of this facility and see what there is inside. This one looks like it might be kind of big. The sentinels spread out across the hills. We can take a look at our leisure. Alarm's still going off in here. Operations center. Well, let's... Can't go in that door. Can't go in that door. All right, too bad. An automatic process has scrambled the output of the terminal. I can make out a few world words, but the rest is lost in static. I'll say, no, oh, those words are nonsense to me. They could lead me to the overseer's workflow and bring the facility back online. Well, they could lead me to the overseer. Let's see, so this is a little guessing game. If I guess the right thing, then I get access to the mainframe and I can have it work for me for a little bit. Let's see. I 
just don't know. Normally there's a hint. Normally it's like, oh, there's a virus ravaging the system. Do what do you want to do to fix it? And you just kind of guess something that makes sense. But this one doesn't make any sense at all to me. So I'm kind of just going to be guessing without any idea what's going on. I'm just going to guess exosuit. I'm wearing an exosuit. Who knows what will happen if I guess one of these other two things. I fail to access the electronic overseer's workflow. I guess if I knew more of the alien language, that's one of the things they have in this game, is you can learn the alien languages and you learn them one word at a time. So I've learned a lot of words. I've learned like 80 words in this language, but I didn't know any of the three words that were my hint to figure out which one of those three things I should have guessed. So, <clears throat> I guess I failed to access the mainframe on this one. But there are these little doors that I can't get into. And I think, I think I am going to leave a marker so that I can come back later once I get a key card that will open those doors. So, it wasn't a complete waste. I got to see a new sentinel that I've never seen before. And I got to find a place that maybe has a treasure vault or something. So I'll come back when I have better keys. Well, I think that's all for today. We'll uh, end this video with a little once around my space fighter. Looks pretty cool, right? Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you all again real soon. Bye now.